and welcome back to episode 21 of TFC Modcraft and in this episode I want to get some more progress done on the automatic crafting system upstairs but first I have noticed I'm beginning to have a little bit of a problem here with my metals chest so I think it's time to see if I can manage to do let's see an alchemical chest. One diamond, a regular chest. Okay. Let's see about that. Uh, oh yes, I threw the diamonds all in here. Let's go for two of these things. Okay. Now we need some smooth stone and what else? The covalence powders, dusts, whatever. These guys. And some iron. Okay. So we've got iron here and here. The dusts. Well, gee, it would be a good idea if I made the chests first. the fun part. I'm going to set one down here temporarily. Because I'm going to make a mess. the stuff out of this one, which is probably what I should have done the first time instead of just breaking the doggone thing. Alright, that's out of there. Put down an alchemical chest in its place. Start throwing that stuff back in there. And I'll worry about organizing the chest content at another time. I know I could use something like uh, inventory tweaks to handle that. However, I have not been able to find inventory tweaks in a Minecraft 1.1 version. So, I'm doing it the hard way. stuff down there. And okay, let's go ahead and put these back. And now I have to adjust the location of that pipe outside so that it will connect with the chest. Alright, there's my glass pipe. It's 
connected, that's going to be enough. All right. So now there's plenty of room for more stuff in there. I didn't want my metals to be going off to be converted or jamming up the system. Okay. You know something? This needs to go in here. And then I can go ahead and break this down. And drop the other alchemical chest here. Remove the sign. And I'll figure out what to put in there another time. Actually, I might end up putting wood in there, as a matter of fact, come to think of it. And speaking of which, I've done a fair amount of mining. And let's see. Tell you what, I'm going to leave this thing in there to charge. And I'm going to head out and uh, cut some wood. I know I need some, so I'm going to go ahead and... Uh, just make myself up an axe or two and go cut down a bunch of wood and then we'll get back to this and get going with some stuff. Alright, I've got a decent amount of wood now so I'm going to go ahead and put the wood and yeah, go ahead and leave the sticks in there and the saplings but not the arrows even if I only have three. Alright, uh, let's see, let's put the mushrooms away. And now I think we can get a little bit done on the auto crafting system. And let's see, where did I leave off here? Making diamond gears. Okay. We got the iron gears. And in there somewhere is the other ones. There, now we can see it. Diamond, gold, crafting table, wooden or stone gear, iron gear, wooden gear, regular crafting table, and sticks. Okay. So let's go ahead and request. Oh, yeah. use the ordering tool. All right. Uh, let's start out with say four or five crafting tables. Missing 15 wooden planks. All right. Let's go on one crafting table. Well, actually, that was a log. So we got logs coming up and a crafting table. And the next thing this thing's going to learn how to do is convert logs to planks and we'll go from there. Let's see. Oh, well, it would help if I had stopped to pick up my logistics pipes. Provider pipe, well, there's diamond pipe, that would be needed eventually. Two crafting logistics pipes left. And just keep that on hand just for the heck of it. Okay. All right. Okay. And this one is going to learn about logs equals planks.
import that. All right. Okay. Next up, let's try for that multitude of crafting tables again. Auto crafting tables give me, say, an even 10. Be glad when I get another basic logistics pipe in there so that that thing will stop bouncing stuff around. But that'll happen soon enough. Everything is getting in there. It's just taking a while. Mistaken. Basic logistics pipe. Glass. Which, okay. I'm going to go down and sleep till day to get rid of this rain and pick up a few things and I'll be back up here. Okay. Got together just about everything I need here. And it occurs to me. I am going to need a couple of more things than what's there. For one thing, I'm going to need some more diamond. So I'm going to do this, take this out of here and keep it to one side. And I'm going to put some glowstone dust here in a target slot and let this thing go to town on some redstone. Meanwhile, get out the Klein Star, drop a couple of Eternalist fuel into it, and I'm going to yank out four diamonds and I'm gonna go ahead and throw them in the chest over there that should make just enough to do what I want to do I hope mm, yeah just barely as long as I don't mess it up and uh, I'm going to have to make another trip to the nether sometime soon so that I can uh, come up with some more glowstone dust or glowstone, whatever. Alright, uh, okay, it looks like I need to make another pipe of this kind right now. Alright, wait a minute. Yeah, alright, good. So, oi. All right, uh, basic logistics pipe. Two gold gears, diamond, glass, two redstone torches. All right. So I need to... Request that. Request a couple of sticks. And two gold gears. And I have the glass on me. And the diamond pipe. Okay, waiting for that last gold gear. While the iron I need goes bouncing around the system. That's okay, that won't be for long. Two 
gold gears, diamond transport pipe, glass, and two redstone torches. And now we give this a whack with the wrench. Import. Bingo. Now we can make basic logistics pipes. So. Ugh. Now let us go ahead and say get. Eight basic logistics pipes. Of course. The ingredients are not in the system. Well, I'm going to put them in the system, and eventually I'll have to get this thing moved around here to hook up to these chests as well, so that all of the chests are in the system. Okay. It also occurs to me I need to show the thing how to make a redstone torch. Which I should have made at least a couple of them and stashed them down there. Otherwise it's just going to complain again. So... That should be everything. Now, basic logistics pipe. Eight of them, please. And this will be the last time stuff bounces around. Because I'll be able to fix that intersection finally. start right there. Basic logistics pipe. We're good to go. No more inefficient bouncing around like a maniac. Alright, that's basic logistics. Crafting Logistics is a basic with two glowstone dust. And I just happen to have... Alright, let's... I don't need to make one more like this. To hook it up there. And now we take a basic and I don't have enough glowstone dust. Well, let's see what I managed to get downstairs. I'll be right back. Okay, I had managed to generate five of them in this time. That's enough. Alright, get out the wrench. Whack the pipe. Now we have crafting logistics pipes being auto-manufactured. And... Let's see, what's the next one there? Provider, I believe. And that's a basic with one glowstone on top. So we take another basic. And... First we'll go over here and request some crafting logistics pipes. Missing glowstone and redstone. Alright, how about one? Insufficient glowstone or redstone torches. Alright, alright, alright. 
I'll be right back get a few things. Okay, I waited around for the system to be able to uh, generate some glowstone dust. And so I'm going to change this one here because I want this thing to know how to make redstone torches and doggone it now. Well, at least redstone I can order. And I like how it's not bouncing around now. All right. Now it knows how to make redstone torches. That should enable it. Why is stuff flying over here? And over there. Okay. Basic logistics pipes coming out the butt. Okay. Wild. I need a crafting logistics. Okay, that's the one with two glowstone. I should have remembered that. It was only a couple of minutes. glowstone left in the system. Yes. Two please. It's funny that I have to make one in order for the thing to know how to make it and Oy. All right, now we're up to making crafting logistics pipes. Let's go ahead and order some of the some of those. missing five gold. Alright, the system is starting to come together, but obviously I need to take a break to go mining. I also need to uh, take a break to go uh, make up some food before I starve to death. So I'm going to take care of those things, sleep through the night, and so on, and I'll be back. Alright, had a decent little mining run there. I went until the destruction catalyst didn't have any more fuel in the uh, Kleinstar. And then from there, I continued until the backpack and the mining drill were empty. Found a decent amount of stuff, a reasonable number of diamonds even, uh, which have already been sent ahead thanks to my handy dandy little enter chest. And everything should be just about totally sorted into the system by now. Let's see, what's the next thing I need to do? Yes, I need some provider pipes so that I can hook the rest of these chests into the system. So, let's see here. It makes crafting, redstone torch, provider. But I need, okay, I gotta go get my pipes. So I put a basic, put a crafting pipe in there, carry my basics. 
I have a few providers, good. There's some glass pipe, there's some more glass pipe. And the one thing I don't have is another crafting pipe, but I can come up with that easily enough. Oh, that reminds me. Let's see how much glowstone we've managed to generate over here. A little bit. Go ahead and throw it in the chest. All but two of them, I believe. Yeah. A basic two glowstone. There's a crafting pipe. And I can go ahead and plug that onto the system, and then it'll be able to make provider pipes or crafting pipes or so whatever that one is that up here. Provider pipes, okay. And get the wrench. All right. Import that system can now make provider pipes as well as crafting pipes and basic logistics pipes. We are getting somewhere. Oh. Okay, I have seven provider pipes. Let's go ahead and get a few more. Missing five gold ingots. Never did come up with that much gold. Okie doke. I'll go ahead with the ones I've got for the moment. I want to get busy getting the rest of this system hooked together. And so, let's see, let's take our glass pipe, our provider pipes, get the destruction catalyst off the hot bar. Provider pipe. And another provider. And a provider pipe there. up here and another one down here and I'm just going to put provider oh well, yeah I got enough of them so all right we are hooked together the system is completed. There is access to everything now. So let's have a look up there at the requester pipe and make sure. And let's not order a wrench. Yes, everything in the system is now available. That much is good. The fact that we don't have enough gold to do anything significant. Oh, that's brass. Okay. We don't have enough gold to do anything significant, but we have access to everything in the system. We have three gold. We have 931 iron. Okay, it looks like everything's hooked into the system. And I'm going to have to do something about the lack of gold. Sure as not sure enough, guarantee it sooner or later I'm going to need it. For something. Hmm. Okay. Well, we got royal buttloads of iron. Let's go ahead and make a trade. Well, 
that's only 32, but it's something. Okay. All of the chests are into the system now. That means I can request anything here. Let's see, I don't think I need... Oh, that's right. I was going to have a requester pipe down here. Uh, let's see. For the time being, that'll do. Let's plug some holes in the floor here. And all right. Requester pipe. Basic with one glowstone under. right on here somewhere and now we have request access down here all right that's good well the uh, system is finally starting to come together things are working there's a lot more auto crafting tables to make and add to the system and we'll get to it However, I think that uh, right now we're right around the 30 minute mark, so I'm going to wrap this up. And in the next episode, we'll get started with a little bit of forestry stuff so that it isn't necessary to go out and manually chop down trees. Take it easy. I'm out of here.